Hello everybody and welcome back to Wildflowers where we have six more days to get all of the bouquets done in time. We also have a date to go on with Wesley. But I'm going to start off by seeing how many bouquets we can make at the moment. Um, I need some more tulips and snowdrops, which is fine because I've got them growing. I always said I'd just take as many as I needed and then we'll... Uh, Double check. Oh, we'll just replant whatever we don't use. Lovely. And let's go and get the witch weed from down here. And then I'll also pop over to Perry's shop, which is, I think opens on a Wednesday. I think it's Monday and Tuesday. It's sharp the same as uh, Zephyr. And if I can, we'll get some more diamonds from Zephyr as well. I noticed I was a bit low on my powered gems, so that's a good a good start to the day, I think. And then we might try... What did we try last time? Was it oranges? I think we did oranges last time, so we could maybe do... And I think we've done mulberries. So I think we could try lemons and limes and pomegranates now. Yes. Let's pop into Perry's first and see what witch weed she has. Oh, yes, we Keeping finally did it. Tidy, huh? Yeah, ha, 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 ha. I apparently just had to keep walking into this shop, did I? Okay. The last three times it didn't work, but this time it works. Indeed. I made some of these brews centuries ago. They collect dust, and then I forget what they are. Ooh, uh, what is that golden one? Did she forget? That. <laughs> it makes the drinker win all the games they play. I brewed it uh, 150 years ago. This is why we don't play the backgammon together. The key ingredient is the hair of a six-toed cat. Vivian Wilde gave it to me. Cleopatra, how many toes do you have? Oh, Cleopatra even, sorry. How many toes do you have? <laughs> she was your uh, great-aunt? Great-great-aunt? Uh, how do humans keep track of this? Great-great-aunt. Vivian always bested me in backgammon, so the potion was my revenge. So you were friends? They were lovers, Tara. Have you not worked this one out yet? I don't kiss and tell, witchling. Good for Vivian. Oh, good for Vivian. Good for you, too. <laughs> not that it's your business, but good is an understatement. <laughs> So, how long have you been in Ravenwood Hollow, exactly? A handful of centuries. I could not say for certain. My earliest memories are of my labors for a sorcerer, who forced me to do his bidding. Oh no. He kept me in an iron amulet, and I could not break free. Wow. He was a greedy man, and he used me to trick his enemies. I did many things I did not want to do. Please don't tell me that there's a sociopathic sorcerer running around this island. That was, sounds like it was many years ago, though. No. Our ship wrecked on the coast of Fairhaven. He ran headlong into the gloaming, only to be possessed by wraiths on the spot. Ariel drove him mad with his cries, and he threw himself into the ocean. Ariel freed me from my prison. The bracelets I wear on my wrists are that iron amulet. A reminder of what, exactly? Everything I did while I was in the sorcerer's thrall. When Ariel freed me, I swore to protect the humans on this island. As penance, I wonder if I will ever be able to undo the harm I caused. Maybe you don't need advice from some mortal spring chicken, but I have advice anyway. Go ahead. Have you considered forgiving yourself instead of waiting for a banner that says, you're forgiven to drop from the sky? A curious idea. No, I had not considered that, but now I will. Thank you, witchling. Yay, we're friends!
friends. Okay, so um, I did also want to buy. I cannot forget now. I'm terrible when a cutscene happens. I usually forget to buy the thing I'm here to buy, but I am here to buy witchweed. That should be enough for bouquets three and four. Uh, we've got six days to go, so bouquet five is not going to be an issue. I did get the one from down by Thomas as well, didn't I? Let's check how many we've got. It'll be under flowers, right? Miscellaneous. I've got five. So I actually just need... I, I, I've i either got enough or it's just one more I need. So it'll be tomorrow we'll have that. Let's make some more bouquets. So, spring bouquet. One. What do you mean I don't have enough snowdrop? Nah, I'll get another snowdrop in my garden. <laughs> it's important. Looks like some of my silk is ready as well. That is number four. Yeah, so number five, as soon as the, it's respawned tomorrow, number five will be ready. So that would be perfect. Just keep going on this so I can make myself cute things to wear. There was something I needed. Ooh, black silk for, uh, black leather for, sorry. What was it? What did I want to use black leather for? I really wanted to make this, didn't I? Purple cloth and purple silk. Go on, let's make that. Um, so I only need some purple dye for that. And then we can go on our date with Wesley. Um, I wanted that so that I could... Why did I want that? Not sure. Um, I've worked out with everyone's, uh, Gloria, maybe? Or something else for Cameron? No, we worked on Cameron. Cameron's on gold now. I want everyone on gold or, or full blue hearts, basically. Worked on Julia. Is it just Sebastian? Kai? Oh, someone had a tip for me. They said... Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, I think I see something. Alcohol-free ale. I have no idea. We were making purple dye, weren't we? And I never actually made any. Would help if I did. Yeah, two purple dye. One for the silk, one for the cloth. Let's put them in the dye bath so I can make myself a really cute dress. Um... And I'll probably sell then some of my other really cute stuff. Or I might even sell this cute dress. I don't know, but I, I kind of really do want to like unlock loads of clothing items. That one's just purple cloth as well. Hmm. So we need purple cloth, purple silk. I have no cloth left. This is why we got a second sheep, though, and why we're now using the greenhouse almost exclusively for for cotton. Purple cloth. And then I'll do, like, another purple... Uh, no, I can't do any more black leather, either. Hmm. Let's see if I can put any more leather on. I've been getting a lot of fish lately for... Various reasons. So we'll do some fish leather. Yeah, and they're... They're... Um... Ooh, hey, Angus. What's this about? Tara! Oh, do you ever think that maybe your name should be pronounced Tara? I mean, it's Irish, right? Yeah, well, that's how I've been pronouncing her name the whole time. Tara. Not terror. Terror. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I've been pronouncing my name wrong my whole life, but I'm kind of committed at this point. 
Hey, I don't judge. Anywho, it's spring fling season. I want to make some hot cross buns. Think you could scare up some honey and butter for me? Fresh churned butter makes the buns so much better. If I don't already have, <laughs> then I can easily make. Here's some freshly churned butter and honey for you, Angus. Perfect! I'll get started on these right away. Uh, come see me at the spring fling and you'll get an extra bun. Nice! I haven't been to the coven to see if they want me to do anything for the spring fling, so I should drop by later and just double check it. Um, just making sure that Gloria's okay. Watching Antonio taught me a lot about how to be mayor. Now that I've been doing this long enough to know, you have to figure out your own way of doing things. Okay, anyway. The... 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 thing that I, was said to me was try going down by the ferry. So... Yes, okay. Kai is here by the ferry. Ah, where's this delivery dude? He was supposed to be on this ferry. The surf is pumping and the winds are going to clock back on shore soon. See, for such a laid back guy, when he gets annoyed, he really gets annoyed. At... Kai, can I help? I can wait for the delivery guy and direct him where to go. Really? Oh, I would be so stoked if you did that. But tell me the truth. Do you think I'm like too obsessed with surfing that's what everyone tells me passion is obsession kai i think that anyone who really pursues a passion risks getting called obsessive by others i do worry about your safety sometimes though <laughs> <laughs> right on and i know i know i i'm trying to be more careful don't tell anyone but I'm thinking of going back to pro surfing full time. That would mean closing the stall. Oh, wow. Nothing's definite yet, so I don't want Dr. Syed catching wind of it. I promise it'll be our secret. Ah, uh, thanks, Wahine. I really appreciate it. What's a Wahine? Bastion, are you? Juliet asked if I was going to the spring fling. I go every year, so I don't get why she's asking. She's asking you out, numbskull. Oh. What? Waiting for a schooner to take you on board to lead the sailor's life? Well, that was good advice about the ferry. Thank you, guys. Huh? No. Actually, maybe. That wouldn't be so bad. At least I could leave Fairhaven. Why do you want to leave so bad? Because nothing is new here. And now that Dad doesn't live with us, I never get to go anywhere. Well, you can just travel on your own. Go on the ferry, go travel. No one's stopping you. I see the same people every day. And most of them treat me like... like I'm this scared little kid because of my mom. <laughs> He's so angry. Oh, bless him. He's not even as tall as Tara. Like, this is the thing I don't get, is that usually boys, by the time... Because I assumed he was a bit younger, maybe like 13, 14, just because of, like, how tall he was. Because quite often guys will be, like, absolutely shooting up by the time they're 14. So he is quite small for his age, I think. At least Damon and Kai seem cool, but Damon won't let me hang out in his bar, and Kai's always surfing. <laughs> Damon and Kai are not cool. There's adventure There's here. There's plenty of adventure right here in Fairhaven. You just have to know where to look. Ugh, oh, you sound like my dad. But I grew up here. I do know where to look. You do now, but maybe when we were meant to have this conversation, you hadn't. I mean, what am I supposed to do? <coughs> Excuse me. Find a secret town filled with dope people who want to hang out with me? Mm-hmm. Secret coven with dope people who want to hang out with it you. It wasn't always like this. After mom did her vanishing egg and dad couldn't be mayor anymore, he traveled. A lot. Looking for work, and I got to go. But he ended up getting a job off island, right? Yep. Back where he's from. 
Now I don't get to go anywhere, and I don't get to hang out with anyone either. Except Juliet, but she's younger than me. And Violet, but like, she's my sister. Man, I just wish I lived in the city. I lived in the city most of my life. It's not all it's cracked up to be. It seems pretty great on TV. Would it help if I told you how much the city can suck? I... I guess? Okay. Um, do you want to hear about the time I got bedbugs? <laughs> or the time that I fell asleep on the subway? Wow. Or when my apartment flooded. Or when my keys were stolen. And she could keep going. Wow. That was three cutscenes in the space of 15 minutes. That is insane. So who have we got left now? Just Amira, Ariel, Bruno. Gloria. Yeah. So we work on cookies for Amira. Ariel. Bruno. Hmm. Well, I guess those will show up eventually. I mean, I I think that's enough for this episode. A grief. I'll check down the ferry for by the ferry for Bruno as well because you know what, I never go there. So if there are cutscenes to be had there, then maybe that's why I've not had a few of them. Can I sell anything? Oh yeah, what I don't know is I always. Fish with the spring fling, something like that. Oh yeah, yeah. He's he's at the he's at the top. So in all the shops. No. Okay. But honestly, that was super good. I'm so so pleased. What was I going to do other than the bouquet today? Just like making clothes, wasn't it? Did we have any other questies? I think so. Alright. So, yeah, like I say, I'll go to the coven, make sure they don't have anything t later. Okay, let's go on our date. Let's go on our date, shall we? To the beach. Oh, it's such a nice day. Would you like to join me for a walk along the beach? I'd love to accompany you. Aww. <laughs> Playing hide and seek in the trees. Oh my goodness. Oh, they're so into each other. It's adorable. Another successful walk along the beach with my love. I never thought it had happened for me. I never want to stop appreciating what we have. Can we do this again? Yes. Oh, and now it's the end of the day. Time for bed. I need to do these things later in the day. <laughs> Mind you, I didn't have much to do that day, so that's fine. Um, we just got to make the last bouquet and hand that in. I don't mind too much. Although I need to check on Planty and make sure that these are getting watered. Oh yeah, that was one thing I didn't do. I was going to see Zephyr. Oh yeah, they're all being watered. Perfect. Right, so let's get that last witch weed. That's going to be the first most important thing. Then I might go and see if Zephyr's open for a little bit of uh, making gems. Then I need to go and make my speed boost longer spell. Maybe we'll do that before we go see Zephyr. I still haven't dug up recipes. I didn't dig up recipes yesterday. I went on the date. That that probably would have been the next thing I did, but it's fine. Let's have a look. Speed boost longer. So when that runs out tomorrow, it will be there for me, ready, without me having to feel like I'm dragging my feet through mud. Right then, so bouquet. And then I can hand those into Violet and not have to worry about that anymore. I was super worried about it for a while though. Good grief. 
Uh, the snowdrops again. I'm glad I planted so many of those, I tell you that. I've used up four plots worth. And two plots worth of tulips. So we can replant those. And just to get the honey production back up to where it should be. And seeing as we'll be going to see Violet anyway, so let's go and do that first. But that is one day to get a one way to get a day to finish earlier if I need it to. I wonder where Gloria's um things are gonna be. Gloria's cutscenes are gonna be. Ooh, are those my bouquets? Mmm. The town square is gonna smell so good. Thanks for this, Tara. This is my mom's first festival since she became mayor, and I just really want it to go well, you know? Yeah. Of course. Anytime. Perfect. Now then, did I ever manage to make that dress? I don't think I did. Is there any dresses or anything I can sell? No. Unless I sold my my overalls again. Mint on demand shorts are on are in demand apparently. Right. Um they do last for a few days as well, these demands, so that might be worth doing. But I would like to get two more of these. And four more of these. I don't really care about buying seeds versus propagating them. I may propagate some just to like see what it's like. <laughs> But so far I haven't even done that yet. <laughs> so bad. Maybe I could get some um, cotton seeds off of Thomas. Do it that way. Okay, so we're struggling a bit for the honey. because Probably because I've taken all the flowers away. So let's plant them back in. It feels so weird being best friends with so many people now. I'm hoping Planty will get over here and plant and uh, water these, though. Seems as we are quite early in the morning. I will double check. Lovely, nice bed of tulips. Nice big bed of... Uh, how did I manage that? Do you know what? I'm going to propagate that tulip seed. And that wheat seed. I don't know, just whatever seeds I have, I'll propagate them. Sell them back to Lena if I have to, or I'll just grow them. Whatever I want to do. So... All done with that. We have five more days before the festival starts. So unless anybody else has any questy, questy things for me to do. I didn't go to see the coven uh, at the end of last night because obviously the thing with Wesley kind of messed that up. The, the date with Wesley. So we will do that tonight. And in the meantime, I will dig up all the dirt piles and do a load of fishing. Uh, I believe as far as I got with the fishing was I still had fish to catch in the ocean and the river. So we'll just keep on trying with that. Uh, no. I'll try. Oh, no, I see it. I see it. I see you. Hiding in that tree. But it was all money. Okay, that's fine. Let me just make sure there's not a fourth one up here. Because some pit sometimes apparently there can be four instead of three, but I've never found more than three personally. Let's go catch a couple of things down by the river and see if any recipes pop up. I'm still missing about I think it was something about 28, 29, 30, around that sort of area. Oh, 
Oh yeah. So it's definitely worth still trying to look for more. I have all the recipes I need to be friends with the villagers. So this is very much um, surplus to requirement. I have the malasada, which is was the recipe I needed for Ariel. Oh, quick! I'm not going to catch you. I'm going to catch your friend. I think. Oh, ha. gotcha! And we can at least see if we can catch a new kind of fish. No, I caught an eel. So what we're missing at the moment, oh actually it won't be in the bag, it'll be in the journal, is three of the fish in the river. And we're missing five on the ocean. So I could go and catch that guy's friend. And then go up the top and catch another one up there. And as soon as we get to about six, seven o'clock, we'll go and visit Coven. Oh yeah! I'll come back in the evening. So far, no bottles, but we haven't been fishing for long. Oh, it's just a stud. Oh, there's a new one here now. Oh, well, it's just going to keep me here forever. That's a salmon kind of looking one. I think the small ones are all stud fish, so I'm going to try not to catch those. Could be wrong. But I think these ones are rarer. Caught a perch, which is one I apparently already had. There's a big fishy in here, though. Might be another perch, you never know. Oh. But once I've caught all the fish, uh, all the types of fish, then I'll just go back, oh, I think, to the mines. And see what I can get down there. But we need to do a little bit more fishing down at the ocean. That's another perch. Okay, I'm starting to get more of an idea of what's what here. I think I want to go to the beach for a bit. Unless this looks different. It could be, actually. It's a little kind of crayfish thing, so it might be another eel. Oh, nice recipe. No, I'm certain you're an eel. I want the recipe instead. Oh, quick, got one. Hang on. This this is Spanish a fish. omelette. Yum it's yum. Some kind of recipe. Like I say, there's um, some people saying that they're getting to about 14, 15 recipes to go and really struggling. And there might be some other way maybe to get them oh, or something. I can only assume they've had all of the ones that are out of the mines at, the, at this point. Nah, another perch. Okay, I'm going to head over to Coven and just double check and make sure that they don't want anything done for the spring fling. Because I did miss a little bit of a thing in springtime for them. Last in summertime, actually. Haha, -ha, painted eggs. Let's see. Tara, I thought I would teach the kids the coven traditions at the heart of the spring egg hunt we've always done in town. Okay. My ancestors used to bury eggs in their land every spring as a fertility rite to help the crops bloom. Well, I can do eggs and I can do beeswax. Dyes might be a bit more difficult. Oh, that makes sense. I read in one of Grandma's books that eggshells make great compost. I want to make dyed eggs with the kids and then set up the egg hunt in town on Spring Fling Day. Could you help me source the eggs and dye? Uh, sure. I'm excited to help. Oh, Tara. I have everything but the purple dye. Give me just a sec, Lena. I'll be right back. I need to do another big, uh selection of potions there uh, okay so i've got loads of leather wonderful and actually oh no let's just <laughs> let's go in the basement 
go in the basement. All right then, so. We need purple dye. Make a couple of them. Back to... Apparently I don't have to leave the basement to use my broom, but I kind of feel weird. Like, brooming it from the basement. Even though apparently flying through a wall is absolutely fine in my eyes. Hey Tara, has the chicken coop been productive lately? Yes, here's the eggs and dye. Oh, oh, those are nice ones. I'm going to boil these up right now. One time I forgot to cook them first and they cracked while we were decorating them. Yolk got everywhere. Let's get started. Ooh, oh. swirly. I'm so going to find the most eggs on Spring Fling Day. Um, Mrs. Dow Johnson, no offense, but I think I'm a little old for egg hunts. You probably are a bit, Sebastian. Yeah, totally. Me too. You're not, but you think, but you want to pretend you are in front of Sebastian. <laughs> no one's ever too old to enjoy spring traditions. And this one holds extra meaning. Eggs were a symbol of new life after a long and cold winter. When you come of age, you'll find eggs are useful for different kinds of magic. And dyed eggs are even more potent. What? What do you mean they're even more potent? No one told me this. Really? That's cool. Okay, I'm gonna hide these around town on Spring Fling Day. What do we get if we find the most eggs? Emmy, not everything has to be a competition. Emmy's ambitious, though. Maybe, but where's the fun in that? Tara, if you want to make your own dyed eggs at home, you'll find they're really handy for certain advanced spells. You can also eat them for a quick boost. Cool. At the spring fling, you'll be able to hunt for eggs around town. And I can now make dyed eggs at my dyeing bath. Ah! Fantastic! That's really filling things in, isn't it? Wow. Um, yeah, let's go home then. So, dyed eggs. See, I knew I needed to check that coven. They didn't have that until a while after. So, like, you need to keep checking, especially a few days before. Right, so, everything is good. Everything is growing as it should be. Are the pomegranates ready for a little harvest? Yes, they are. That's one thing I haven't checked yet is, um, oh, but you know what? I think they'll be asleep. So tomorrow we'll do a little chicken run, a little chicken test with pomegranates, I feel. Actually, Wesley, do I have any wine for you or any like pork roasts or anything like that? Do I have any presents that you would like? I want to get all these dates unlocked, you see. I made a mystic bouquet. I wonder if you'd like that. I've got loads of wine though, so we'll just carry on with the wine. Oh, I can't wait to drink some of this while reading the latest detective novels that came in. I'll let him say it sometimes. <laughs> the other day, Cameron asked me to teach him how to make salmon broth soup. I said, why not? He's done a real 180 on the book of the mind. He's, yeah, so much better now. Really, really is so much better. So like, can I, can, we can't go on a date at the moment. So I can only go on a date once per heart. Okay, I so I should always go on the new one. Oh. We're getting through the days fast though. <sighs> Although I think we might not have the spring fling until next episode, maybe. Well, an hour to go. At the spring fling, you'll be able to hunt for eggs around town. I don't want to get more than Emmy, though. She'll be so disappointed. <sighs> I feel like I need to follow Amira around. Tuesday, Monday and Friday and Sunday. She's closed. So it might be somewhere else. Hmm. I'll have a look for her in a minute, I think. Oh yeah, that's worn off, hasn't it? Ah! Oh, I had a 
speed boost spell that Wesley gave me. The time for walking slow has passed. Lighten my feet and make me fast. I remember that. Oh, so cute. Get these uh, silks going. Okay, it's just that one doesn't have it. Let's also grab these. I do need to keep giving Ariel his presents, so I've kind of stopped doing that for some bizarre reason. Um, it was this little dress, wasn't it, I was going to make? So cute! Blue, if I made a blue cloth and a yellow cloth and a green cloth, I could make a few things actually. Definitely make a blue cloth. I can definitely make a yeah. Oh, that's blue silk I'm making. Rats. The yellow cloth. I'll use it for something. Maybe a black cloth. We'll work it out. I'll just make loads of different cloths and silks and leathers and see what comes together. But yeah, okay, let's try it on before I sell it. I want to at least see what it looks like on. <gasps> oh, that dress is everything. That dress is amazing. I'm gonna sell that. I have the pattern for it. I can make, remake it anytime I want, and I do want more patterns. All the patterns. I wish I had more oh. to show you, darling. But the truth is, none of my gems are as lovely as the one you're already wearing. Well, um, I actually went in the wrong shop there, but I'm glad I did. <laughs> Where did you get it? Oh, my ex gave it to me. It's gorgeous, that, uh, that necklace. It really is nice. What do you think, Tara? Am I crazy to still wear it? No, it's beautiful. Of course not. No one we once loved ever truly leaves our hearts. Oh, that's beautiful. Now I feel bad for burning that nice shirt my ex gave me. You should. That's just a crime against fashion. Oh, look at those earrings. They would bring out the green in your eyes. Or maybe this ring instead. You have such graceful hands. Which do you prefer? Earrings. Usually, I prefer earrings only. I already have a ring from someone else. I'm putting all my spare income back into the farm at the moment, unfortunately. But they are really beautiful, Francis. Amira is now my good friend, so we need to keep working on you, don't we? Because I need to... Probably now, anyway. Give you some more cookies and see how that affects you. It's funny. When I was in med school, my mother used to come fill up my entire cupboard with oatmeal raisin cookies. She knew I would turn to sugary snacks when pulling all nighters, so she wanted to try to at least make them healthy. I love my family, but being here saved me. They expect so much, but I can't live my life for them. No. That's how I feel too. I didn't start to find myself until I landed here. Yay, okay, so we've got a little bit of work to do for that fourth half if we want it. Sadly, I've got to take this cute, cute dress off. Get back in my overalls. And sell that to Violet. And see if selling it will get me some nice, yummy patterns. Oh, she wants the lilac. Oh, the pistachio daydresser. I'm making the stuff for that. Oof. Yeah, that was enough to unlock three new designs. The Clementine Cordial Frilly. Uh, the Scratch Chalkboard Jacket design. And the uh, Alo... Aloy Ahoy romper. Well, that one looks kind of like what Violet wears, except she's got a pink and uh, turquoise version. 
So we could be like twinsies. <laughs> so much, much less to unlock now. We're getting there with all these designs. Um, but the lilac romper and the pistachio day dress are the things of the day. I'm sure I'm getting the stuff together for the pistachio day dress. Do you know what the other thing I should check? Is, is Bruno's open today? I want to check by the ferry on a day that Bruno isn't open. So, yeah, it's closed on a Friday. Let's check. Okay, and uh, Damon wants something. No, he's not around, so that's fine. Let's see what Damon wants, because it'll be a spring fling thing, probably. That's <laughs> always a good time. It's cute to see who pairs up with who in the light. What happened there? He, like, literally had a thing that he wanted, and then he didn't. How weird. I feel terrible for not going and seeing him straight away. Oh no. Oh, you want something too. Tara, I hear you're helping with the spring fling. It doesn't exactly line up with Passover this year, but I thought I'd make some matzo ball soup for everyone anyway. After all, the spring fling is all about love and my matzo ball soup is like a warm hug. But the key is making the stock from scratch. I just need a few things. Think you could help? Sure, I love hugs, even if they're the soup variety. Okay, I need a bone, three carrots, and some flour. Let's see. Any chance you've got this? That's the key to really fluffy matzo ball. Mine are light as air. Hmm. Sounds so yum. I should have them for you soon. Thanks. So we have to keep um, stroking Cleocatra. I must have used all the bones for the bone soup. I can't believe Damon, you didn't. You're not gonna tell me what you want. It's so annoying. Lesson for me, never run past someone when they've got a request. Ever. But we did find Sophia's request by running into him, so I guess. Let's see. It would be lovely, Cleocatra, if you could give me a bone. I'd be really happy. Oh, what a good purse. Yeah. Thanks! And then it was some carrots, which I might get from Lena. Let me check, because otherwise I'll need to grow them and I don't think I have time. I think I might have used all my carrots for like Wesley's presents. Lena, do you sell carrots? Please sell carrots. No! Sells carrot seeds, which will be ready in five days. No! <laughs> so, what we're going to need to do... Is speed them up a touch. Uh, I should get four carrots out of each one, so it should only need to be one. If I have to clear out a... No, I've got space. Okay, cool. I was going to say, if I have to clear out a space, I clear out a space. So, pop those in. Hopefully, Planty will water them while I'm gone. And what I want is a mega boosting potion. So, let's see. Miracle Grow, Ultra Miracle Grow. Instant Brew. I'm going to regret not having the forget me nots, but I don't care. 
Doing a bit of witchcraft to get a bit of a boost on this. They will be ready in three days. Alright, well that is fine because the, the thing is in totally... Four days? Four days. They'll be ready before now, that's fine. So we'll get the Matsu soup done. And I wanna, I'm gonna hang around and see like... I'm hanging around Damon now because I'm like, you had a thing you needed me to do. I need to know what it is. Ah, it's back now. Cool. Damon, there you are. Look, something really weird is happening, and it all started after I went to your bar. Ah. I tried that new cocktail of yours, the Sweet Kiss, and now all of a sudden, everyone is acting weird towards me. Cameron came by and told me I looked really pretty today. Did you put charm potion in it? Kim dropped by, gave me some free steak, and Kai offered to teach me how to body surf. Listen, I know you're a witch, and that's fine, I guess. But was there something in that drink besides mixers? Well, maybe. <laughs> Demon? I just put a little charm potion in it to put everyone in the spring fling mood. But I think I made Natalia's a bit too strong. <laughs> Can you fix it? Scratch that. Tara, can you help? I am not taking any more of Damon's concoctions, magical or not. I'll try. Maybe Perry has something that could help. <laughs> uh, a potion to undo charm potion. <laughs> Love it. See, every time I think I'm done with everything, something else pops up. So yeah, Sophia, literally, it's going to be the day before. Why am I going? Why do I always think they're in the mines? Why do I always think that? I'm like, Perry will totally be in the mines. No. No, that's not where they live. We've managed to do quite a lot of the stuff. Uh, I think the matzo soup is the last thing. Perry. Do Perry, you know? Is there a chance you might have a recipe for a potion that could cool a charm effect? Natalia needs my help. Ah, that explains why I've suddenly felt drawn to a mortal woman again. <laughs> Let me guess. Damon has been brewing more than beer lately? Yep. Not to sell him out, but yeah, that's exactly what happened. Mm hmm. <laughs> Very well. I have an ardor cooling potion recipe that should do the trick. Okay. I need to brew that for Natalia. But that's in Perry's shop, is it? I need to purchase it. Yeah, so we need to pick that up tomorrow morning. In the meantime, let's give Ariel a present. Ariel's one of the few people left now. It's Bruno, Amira, and Ariel left, isn't it? At this point. Have a malasada. Took me a long time to get that recipe, so... Oh, I cannot resist. Ooh, look how close that is now. Yes. We might have everybody being our best friends by the end of spring at this rate very close to it i did want to head over to yeah definitely to ravenwood first thing tomorrow and if it just ends up being a case that i don't find bruno's <laughs> final cutscene it'll just be a case of like i will follow you around for an entire week while also making clothes there's a few bits and pieces here 
She really wanted the pistachio day dress and the lilac like romper thing. That's purple cloth, purple leather, yellow silk thread. So I don't really have the right colours for that one. Oh, in the summer, I really want the ladybug one. It's a gorgeous. I'm going to make that for the summer. And I'll sell my other, my other ones. Um, I have almost everything I need for that one, except for some black leather. I could dye some leather black. What am I missing for everything else? I, I will, I'll dye some leather black, but... And I will see if I can make some more fish leather. I think I might be out of tanning solution. So yeah, let's make some more tanning solution so I can make more leathers. Bit low on the old... Uh... Use nigella instead or get me not or witch weed or heather. Actually, heather might be a good one. Oh, I don't have any of that. Okay. Do I have any Nigella? I do just about. Bit low on that as well. Okay, never mind. Uh, do I fly across the coven and just check if anything else is needed? Yeah, let's just make sure. I have done the one quest we had across there, but I want to make absolutely sure there's nothing else. And then in the morning, we'll sort out Natalia. Uh, we'll get the, the potion. I'll get a few more gems off of... No, that's absolutely fine. We're good. Uh, I'm going to go to the mountain. I'm going to dig up my recipes. I've been a bit involved with other things lately. I haven't really been working on the old recipes. But I haven't forgotten them. I'm just being less obsessive about it. Is it? Ooh. Oh, it is a recipe. Ooh, the blue Hawaiian cocktail. Nice. Third one. Then I think I might go and fish down the. No, oh, will I fish down the beach? No, I'm gonna fish near my house because it's actually getting quite late. I might have more time tomorrow. Now, let's get this other one. It looks interesting. Maybe one I haven't had before. Purple. Purple fish are the best. I caught a sucker. Sadly, that was not a fish that I have uh, not had before. <laughs> if that makes any sense. But sometimes they can have the same design in the water and not, uh, and still be like something different. So there are only about three different designs of the big fish. There's like the, the lobster looking one, there's the purple one, and then there's the sort of red one. At this point, if I get one recipe a day, I'll be happy. <laughs> I'm not even guaranteeing that I'll have all the recipes by the end either. It was never an, it was never a thing I was particularly looking for. I caught a crawfish. So we're still missing three. But I think it's home time now. I gave it a good shot. Uh, like I say, there'll be days where we have more time for fishing and days where we have less time for fishing. Is it time for bed? It is time for bed. <sighs> I'll probably, if there is storyline that pushes us towards summer, I'll probably go for that quite quickly now because we are at a point where we've got lots of recipes. We've done what I think is most of the quests um, for the spring. We've 
gotten a lot of the cutscenes now. So I've only got three people left to get cutscenes for. Hey Shelby. Shelby comes here on a Saturday. Get all his bits and bobs. Oh, I've come here way too early. Because I'm a silly billy. I'm not going to get anything there this time of day. So what I should do is look for recipes until things are ready. Make sure my carrots are growing, they're important. I'll go and check on them. I could have probably planted them outside because they are like a spring recipe, but... Yeah. Hmm, there's no new soil patches today. Oh, because they're all over here, good grief, okay. That's a new one. 28 money. Is it? <gasps> oh, it is a recipe. Yay, cabbage soup. I'll have a look and see how my recipes are looking. Two. Oh, is cabbage soup one here? I don't know. Four there. One, two, three, four, five there. Four there. Five there. Four there. Well, that's definitely filling in. Very much so. Okay, so let's head over to Ravenwood Hollow now. Everything will be actually open. And let's go and see Perry for the potion. Zephyr for the gems. And give a present to Ariel. So it's getting really close to finishing that heart off. Be in his shop then, won't he? Right then, so Perry. You wilds have come to Ravenwood Hollow for centuries. I see all their faces in yours. Must be crazy. So the Arda cooling potion recipe. Can I see from here what that entails? One emerald, two moon flowers, and some dragon's blood. I really need to go and put another dragon's blood um, set of spiles on. I was going to do that and I, f and I forgot because I needed more gold for it or something, didn't I? Well, let's not forget to do the things I want to do today, which is... Go see Ariel. Give him a peanut roll. Oh, I cannot resist. And talk. Zephyr is so much like her ancestors, but very different. She's more interested in humans than they ever were. And especially if the humans make cakes. Like that lovely blonde fellow. <laughs> okay, well, we're getting there. Another couple of, of uh, rounds of peanut rolls I think it will be good so I won't need to make anything new uh Zephyr hi we still don't have the best one though do we perfect then let's go yeah definitely want to go and put some some spiles on the dragon trees I wonder how many I already have. Let's have a little look. Maybe I even made them. I don't have any gold. Ah. Question is, do I already have spoils? And if I did, would I even know where they would be? I don't think I do. Okay, 
Let's just go and make a load, like eight more gold. Or 20 more gold or whatever. It doesn't matter. Tara, there you are. Did Perry have anything that might help? Hello. You're looking so lovely today, Natalia. Here, I baked some extra scones for you. Gee, thanks. This is what it must be like to be Tara. Do you see what I mean? People keep dropping by. I can't get any work done around here. Don't worry. I'm brewing up a solution. Good. Hurry. Give me some gold first, because you're going to use up my last bit of dragon's blood. Right, so... Let's just make those spirals. If that's even how you pronounce them, I've no idea. And we'll just stick them on the trees, and then if I do need to have to grab them later, then I've got them ready ahead of time. And in fact, let's just... It's quite a long run, isn't it, that one? Whee! And I need to check on those carrots as well. And it's level three. And the dragon blood trees were this way, were they not? Yeah. Let's go and tap them. Oh, I had made them already, so I've got two rounds. I just had no idea where to find them. Better to have too many than too few though, right? Especially when you're as flush with resources as we are right now. Okay, so in eight days time we'll have a new little stock of that. Perfect. Something to collect on every level of the gloaming. So, what am I going to do now? Make the unlove potion. Check the carrots. I'll put myself in front of the greenhouse because the carrot will be the thing I'll forget. Two days remaining. It's fine, and it looks perfectly watered and everything like that. There's honey to grab as well. Oh yeah, my tulips. <laughs> I wonder how these are going. Couple of days, four days. Those, six days for those. May as well do some seed propagation. It's not really a thing I particularly need, but you know. What I do need is lemons. Lemons are required for the tanning solution, I think. And also for like yellow dye and stuff like that. So they're important. I was going to go and check on my animals, wasn't I? But it's raining and they'll be inside. They're so much more annoying to deal with when they're inside. So maybe we'll do that another day. If I need a shiny egg, I can get a shiny egg. It's not this it's very low down the priority order. Right. So I've dug things up this morning, then I went to Ravenwood Hollow, I've got the things off Zephyr, I've got the love potion stuff. Uh the carrots are growing. Then Arda Cooling Potion will be ready in 7 hours 50 minutes, which will bring us to about 10 o'clock at night. So I'll probably need to just grab those in the morning. So until then, I think it's a case of fishing. I Because it's quite early in the day, I'm going to run up and down the beach fishing and just see if I can find any of the five fish that I am missing from there. I don't know whether, I don't know how seasonal fishing actually is. But 
but it's kind of what we do at the moment when we're got a minute to spare. Start on the fishy fish. If I get a recipe, great. If I don't, then okay. Oh, yeah. If I get two recipes a day, I'm happy right now. There are days where I get zero because either I forget to go and looking for them because there's other things to do or I just don't find the right ones. There's a big fat fish in there. Oh, let's grab him. Or the recipe. I wonder how many of the, I wonder if I would have finished the fish thing by now. Oh, I nearly clicked then. I would have been so cross with myself. Okay, to finish that thought, I wonder how many fish... Whether I would have Hang had the on. whole collection done. This isn't a fish. Green cheese bagel. Yeah, I wonder how <laughs> how many fish I would have gotten had the bottle not popped up at that exact moment. Wow. It's not the first time that's happened, actually, that I fished in the same spot and had a bottle twice. That's three recipes today, then. Gosh, I nearly missed that. Is it a... It is a recipe. Arroz con... Who is it? Huevos, I think. Arroz con huevos. Yeah, I can always try again there. I mean, it's a lucky spot, right? <laughs> Doubt I'm going to get a third one, though. <laughs> it's like the magical oh. bottle spot. Oh my goodness. Oh, got one. Hang on. This isn't a fish. It's some kind color. of recipe. Want to give us favorites. Oh, they took my spot away now. How dare they? Well, that was amazing. So many then. Such a good fishing day. So what is my recipe looking like? What are they looking like now? I fit I've got one thing left to get in raw foods. Four, four, three. Still five drinks. One, two, three, four, five. And still five desserts. Five drinks, five desserts, two. Wow. I can't have that many left to find. Oh, got one. I caught a soul. He's a very happy soul. I always like to think back to when I was like struggling in the mines. I always wonder to myself like if I had this many recipes oh, back then what it would have been like. Much easier I expect. I was just making restorative tea as much as I could because it was all I could really make. Now, which one do I go for? There's two big fish here. Gotcha. I guess you then. A 
snapper. I think I need to go home now then. Let's uh, get in very late. But I feel like we did a good job. Pick up the witch weed. I think it's needed for maybe a run faster spell. If I run out of forget-me-nots and Perry can't provide them to me, I'm going to need to really... I can't get them anymore. Um, so I'm going to need to like really be careful. Should I go to bed? And at the moment, I'm literally using them for tanning solutions. So it'd be my own fault. <sighs> I should buy all the flowers off Berry, really, shouldn't I? Okay, we definitely got one day left in this, maybe two. I've been a bit neglectful of Wesley lately, I am aware of that. Uh, two days left on the carrots. Oh yes, right, so. My love potion, or my anti-love potion should be done. My ardor cooling potion. Don't give it to Wesley, he'll fall out of love with me. I'll be so sad. Oh wow, the cotton's all really sprouted up. Lovely. Carrots are looking very carroty. They have one day left. I could boost the production, but I don't think I need to do that particularly. Um, right, yeah, no, no, Natalia yet. We'll be opening up at nine. Do I wait till nine? Or do I go and... Oh, it's Sunday. No, let's go to the Consciousness Center. That's where Natalia will be on a Sunday. I thought it was a Saturday for a second there. <laughs> you hiding the eggs, Lena? Oh no, she's doing yoga. I see. Gonna check this uh, this fairy end, just to make sure no one's up here. Sebastian. That's where Sebastian hides a lot, though. If we ever want to see him again, which we don't need to right now. But uh, yeah, looking for Nat Nat Natalia, who will be in the Consciousness Center. Welcome, everyone. Today, we turn a new chapter yeah. in the Book of the Mind. That's right, just... Yep, yep, throw that book away. Throw that book away. We're writing our own story from now on, and I know it's daunting, frightening, terrifying, even. <laughs> Cameron is terrified. But, but we can do it, so long as you have faith in me. I, I, I mean, yourselves. Hey, here you go. Please tell me you've got a cure. Marty just offered me some free chicks. <laughs> I don't have anywhere to keep chickens, Tara. There will be chicken poop everywhere. Yes, drink this. It should cool things down. Thank you. Give the potion some time to work its magic. Let's hope it doesn't do anything worse. <laughs> Hilarious. Visit her while she's working. Okay. Waiting on the carrots. Festival in two days. Cool. Right. Is there anyone else that I need to check on for... Oh, it's just a mirror and... Okay. Right, I want to find Bruno. Let's see where Bruno is at the moment. I don't know whether that would lead to a cutscene, but we'll find Bruno uh, wherever he is. Pick up some shells and stuff. I don't know. Ooh, a pearl. Nice. <laughs> Save me a bit of money, because I totally don't have enough money. <laughs> Bruno down here? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. You got a minute? Cutscene number four for this episode. I've been keeping a bit of a secret. I'm all eaten up inside over it. Figure you're a safe person to spit it out to. 
Of course, Bruno. What's on your mind? I thought Otto would get off to a fresh new start moving away from me and all. And everything seemed good for him and the missus. Mm. She called me last week. Otto's gotten himself in trouble again. The law's finally caught up to him for embezzling Fairhaven's funds. He's gonna be in prison a while over it. Oh no. I can't believe I messed up with him so badly. I'm glad Helena isn't around to see how I failed our boy. Would you mind keeping this all to failed yourself himself. for now? Not sure if I want this being the talk of the town. Oh, Bruno. All anyone can do is their best. I think you do yours. Even if Otto doesn't. Thanks, Tara. Appreciate you listening. Okay, best friends with Bruno now. So that was the last cutscene that I think we can just trigger. I was expecting him not to have that up over his head. I was expecting like, yeah, I've got to find him at a real certain time and a real certain place and la 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 la. But no, it was kind of all right. So now, Amira Ariel. Gloria. Let's find out a bit more where Gloria goes and things. So Saturday and Sunday might be the time to get her. Um, I wonder where she goes on a Sunday. I wonder if she'll be in the woods or in the bar or <laughs> in the cafe. Because she's another one I think is due a cutscene but we haven't been able to trigger it while she's at work. And she works Monday to Friday. So, we were trying to find where she is. Because we won't be able to do that until next weekend otherwise. I'm almost certain it'll be something that she does outside of work hours. But once she's out, she's like Lena. Once she's out of work, she'll be in Coven. So, let's see if she hangs out in the woods at all. Mira. And there's Lena. But no Gloria hanging out in the woods. Okay. So that's a good thing to know. She does, she doesn't... So I'm trying to basically track movements at this point. Where do people go? What do they do? Where do they hang? Didn't see anyone on the beach either. I could check next to Sebastian. I don't think she's in the consciousness centre either. Not seeing her in Sophia's. Not seeing her here. Not seeing her on that bench where Parker sometimes sits. Like I say, didn't see her on the beach. Let's check the ferry terminus in case she's decided to go and sit next to Sebastian down here. No. Hmm. Mountains, maybe? I haven't seen her around the mountains. I'm up there all the time. Violet's shop? Might have been there in the day. Hmm. She might be one I'll just have to wait till next weekend and follow her around like an absolute hawk. Um, in the meantime, Amira, uh, who's just walked right past me, could do with a cookie. Where's she gone? I feel like she was kind of headed back to the clinic area. Ah. Might have gone inside. Okay, I think uh, for today I probably won't be able to get presents to any of them, but maybe I could get one to Ariel. So it's Ariel, Amira, and Gloria at the moment. So there's only three left, and one of them is the brand new one. So I'm not feeling too bad about that. So it's just going to make it to get Amira up to the right level, then see if I can... Work out where the cutscene is for her, the final one. So it's only one left. That's not too bad. And same with Ariel. Couple more presents, I think, and we should be there. It's a good I thing to do. I love tending to dragonlings. They hiss Ooh. in my face, so I hiss right back. Ha <laughs> 
Uh, we have a grand time. I have animals that hiss. Cats and ferrets both hiss. I don't tend to hiss back, though. If the ferrets bite, I might squeak to let them know that I've hurt. I'm hurt. But that's about it. Oh, I cannot resist. And with Tilly, if she like goes for my leg, I stay really still and I look at her and I go, Tilly, and she goes, <laughs> and she just completely like, she knows she's in trouble. Bless her. She's old enough now to know this at twelve. Well, she, actually, not quite 12. She'll be 12 in June. Uh, was there anything else I wanted to do over here? No, I think we're okay. So we need to catch Natalia at work, which we won't be able to do until tomorrow. Now then, recipes. I don't think I went to do them. I think I just went to see Natalia. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. I am completely right about that. I just went to see Natalia straight away because I was excited about the love potion or the anti-love potion or whatever you want to call it. So I didn't bother. Uh, hear me? Yeah, there we are. That's the third one. But it's just money today. How many recipes do I have left to get? Let's see whereabouts I am with it. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Twenty left, so I think we will still have some to find. Like I say, people are starting to struggle around fourteen, fifteen. But whether that's just that they're becoming less and less and less likely, I don't know. So like it might take several days to dig up a to dig up a recipe there or several day several oh, million fish to like actually get anything out of the fishing. No. Oh, it looked like it had bitten. I suck. Oh, well, at least it's still there, so we can we can give it a go. Sorry, Fishy, am I in your way? <laughs> Why don't you ever dig me up any recipes? I feel like I need to, to dig to fish up the fish myself for it to really count too. I'm not certain, but I think so. So basically I feel like when it's late at night, I'll fish in the river. Yeah. And when it's I've got lots of time in the day, I'll fish in the ocean. Mountain gloaming and mountain gloaming and um woods pond are all done. The lake in the woods. All done. So do I try and get more or do I just go to bed? Hmm, I think I need to go to bed, but uh, I will. Actually, maybe I could harvest some stuff before I go to bed. This will be the end of the episode. So the spring fling will not be until next time. But I feel like we've had enough excitement today. We've had about four different people's cutscenes. And a date with Wesley. A new date with Wesley. So I feel like we've had plenty of excitement. Talking about dates for Wesley. Let's make sure you've got... An... I'm going to give you the bouquet. It's incredible how vibrant autumn colours are. I very much appreciate the thoughtfulness, Tara. Because men love getting bouquets. They told me. <laughs> Is it time for bed? Yep. <sighs> night night, Tara. I gotta go and cook some some uh, enchiladas now, so I have to say goodbye to you. I will I will see you either later today or tomorrow. Where we will be doing the spring fling, so I hope you will join me for that. 
and hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. Hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.